think a healthy relationship is when two people have good communication. They're loyal to each other. They're very honest with each other and open. And basically when they want to, they show how much that they want their relationship to work. Basically when two people can communicate with no problem and can, you know, see eye to eye with each other. A healthy relationship is where you can tell your partner everything and they don't judge you. They um, take you for who you are. A healthy, a healthy relationship is, you know, when, when you have a lot of communication. Healthy relationship is when a male and a female come together, they communicate. They show love for each other. What do you think is the number one ingredient for healthy relationships? For me, it is honesty and trust. A pediatrician. I want to do, I want to be a forensic psychologist. I think I just want to be something that my little sisters and little brother can look up to. I wanted to be an accountant. It's a nice job. And like every little kid's dream, I always dreamt of being in the NFL. You know. Um, but honestly, I just want to be something that helps me support me and my family. Your parents. Okay. Psychiatrists. You can go basically to, I wouldn't say anybody because not all people are able to give you the right help that you need. So you can go to therapy, um, there's for whether for yourself. So you can fix yourself to be better for the relationship or relationship counseling or you both try to fix each on um, yourself so that way it could work. So counseling, you can go to a clinic or even probably even couples that you look up to because if you think they have a good relationship they could probably give you advice on how to keep it going.
How can healthy relationships help you realize your dreams? Well, honestly, I feel like a healthy relationship is what begins your dreams. I know. There's, there's a lot of people out there that couldn't have gotten where they are without the help of others. And I feel that you have to establish a healthy relationship with those people before you can get to that level. If you have a healthy relationship with someone, then that person will try and push you in the right direction. Will try to help you achieve where it is that you want to be. So, like, for example, I have a good relationship with my mom. So she's going to do everything she can to possibly help me go and do what it is that I want to do. Often times, other people can see a good in you that you don't see in yourself. I feel like being in a healthy relationship, I can achieve goals I never thought I can achieve on myself. Because when you're in a healthy relationship with a person, like they can help you, like what you, what you want to be, or like support you or whatever you want to do. I mean, when you make mistakes, you learn and you figure out how to grow and then you move on. Mm -hmm. Hopefully next time you get it right. If you did something wrong one time, common sense is going to tell you not to do it again, okay? Art and music can make a healthy relationship because it's a different way to communicate with each other. Art and music is creativity. If you listen to music, if you do art, your own form of art, doesn't matter what style, it can really expand your range of how you think about certain things.